Okay, Capper here, and this is going to be another first for us. So I got this used hot tub, and we're trying to get it in position because I got an electrician coming next week. So the way I got it lined up here is uh, the center of both of these chains is about the center of the hot tub this way. So when I lift, it should be fairly centered. I got roughly the same lengths by eyeballing them. And uh, the goal is going to be to bring it down and put it on the patio and at least get it close. I'm going to estimate it's about at least a thousand pounds, 800 for sure, because they had four, we had four strapping young men loaded on when I got it and it was heavy. So uh, let's give it a whirl, see what happens. Okay, we are going to try lifting the hot tub. Okay, we got the 2x4 out. The thing that I don't like here, I think I'm gonna go, I'm gonna, I'm gonna back it downhill because if I turn to my right with the uh, hot tub on a downhill slope, I've done that before, it could tip, it could tip the tractor up uh, onto your front wheels. And let me tell you, that is a scary feeling. Uh, I did that with the Coyote once on accident, of course. And I'm going to tell you, it was scary. So when you got a heavy load on like this, if you have a choice of going uphill or downhill, you want the heavy weight to be uphill uh, and then you back it in reverse so you know the other thing like right now I gotta let it down really easy and, you know if you get a bunch of momentum you can snap it where you uh, lift your back tires up so right now so far so good tipped down so I was only on the front tires 
the brakes didn't work because I believe they only work for the back tires. So I'm starting to roll downhill like this and I clicked it quick in four wheel drive and I was rolling and I kind of went and then, then it caught in four wheel drive then it caught it and uh, I was able to lower the boom, the loader and then get the tractor tire back on the ground, the rear tire. So anyway, that's how I know it's better to go in reverse when you're on an incline like this. seat and then a lower seat over here 
It's supposed to be a three person, but I'm gonna guess it's more of a two, which that's all right. If we have some company, we'll squeeze in there. But uh, another step, another chess piece moved in the big picture. After uh, a while, this should really help my hips and backs and just relaxing. I mean, look at a beautiful view out here. Can't hardly beat it.